Hey guys, Ricardo here and welcome to another blog tech tips. In today's tutorial guys, I'd like to show you a fix which I um, discovered with the Galaxy Book Pro. Now of course this is the Galaxy Book Pro and as you can see here guys, this is the entirety of the device. Now the Galaxy Book Pro, um, one thing I've realized over time when using it is that it suffers from accidental clicks with the um, touchpad. Now of course I have it on a firm surface here but um, whenever I'm using the touchpad, I realize that I'll get accidental clicks where if I'm browsing, something will be selected that I do not want to be selected. Or if I'm going through a bunch of stuff that's on screen, you may find that stuff gets selected. I'll try to reproduce the issue as seen here. So I'm going to open up a um, set of my files. I'm just using the touchpad and I'm just going to move back and forth between the files to see if something gets selected. Ah, there you go. Now I didn't click and I didn't double tap. Now I didn't tap. If I wanted to select something, I would naturally go ahead and um, tap. I'll just go ahead and tap. And once I go ahead and tap, it would be selected, but I didn't tap. I was basically scrolling. And of course stuff gets selected all the time randomly. I do not know if this is only for me but of course, I've had um, other friends use this particular um, touchpad and they're suffering from the same error where stuff gets accidentally clicked. Now, um, I've found a solution to this and I'm going to show you how I actually um, was able to deal with the problem. But first, I'm going to run through the process that I did. So the first thing I tried, guys, was to go to Start. I went to Settings. And the first thing I thought of was to go to Bluetooth and Devices. I'm correct here. I scroll down. I went to touchpad. And of course, I went over to um, taps. Now, of course, one of the things you could try is to disable um, to tap with a single finger. So um, you could try disabling tap with a single finger, which would prevent you from using the touchpad as a clickable um, device. So for example, normally you would double tap or just tap to click you could disable that however it will disable the functionality of the touchpad in that you'd have to click the harden button each time you want to click which is gets kind of annoying especially with that solid click sound all right you could try that um that doesn't really work out but one of the things i thought would have worked was to turn the um the touchpad down to a low sensitivity so that's one of the key ones i suggest so make sure that you turn the touchpad down to a low sensitivity now when you turn the touchpad down to a low sensitivity you can try again to browse but i thought um i was getting the the error, the error just the same so one thing i've realized guys is that is that guys if you treat the touchpad and this is the fix i turn the sensitivity down to low as you saw earlier on screen then i divided the touchpad in um half and then four quarters so off and this would be the lower quarter so normally when i'm scrolling i would do something like this i would use the entirety of the trackpad to fix the issue i realize if i keep my finger within the lower quartile which would be here and maybe i could go up just a little bit but never going beyond the halfway point so basically i keep my fingers in the lower quartile so i'll show you what i mean so if you're scrolling keep your fingers due down here and I realize that if I keep my fingers to the edge and scroll I can move quite nicely without as much going up into the half section so I hope you am being clear so keep your fingers down here and keep it limited to this quartile the lower quartile um, it works I find that once I do that I do not have the accidental clicks I don't know if this tip will work for others if it has just go ahead and try it out and if it does work, go ahead and say it works in the comment. But I can give you a quick demonstration. So if I go ahead, guys, and open up. Let me just open this up first. If I open up, let me open up. And I'm going to use the, the pad now. Check it out, guys. As before, I'm going to run the cursor back and forth over the icons. And by now, I would have um, initially clicked on something and it would have caused... It would have caused an accidental click by now but if i do this and simply keep my fingers on the lower quartile 
notice that I can scroll perfectly fine and without um, that problem. Now, of course, this seems to be a Samsung um, touchpad issue. And of course, and of course, once I was able to figure that out with the lower quarter, I was um, I was able to use this touchpad perfectly. Um, you could get a mouse. So if you have a mouse um, using, it does work fine. However, if you must are in an emergency situation where you don't have a mouse and you must use the touchpad, keeping your hand to the lower quartile solves the problem perfectly. Once I do that, guys, I can move through menus without accidentally selecting anything. I can do everything just fine by using the lower quartile. All right, it took a while to figure that out. But of course, it's a problem with these touchpads. So Samsung needs to improve their touchpad software. They need to make sure that those accidental um, clicks that's happening, that they will do a software update to fix that. But just in case they don't, just remember you can use the lower quartile or the section here that's close to the hedge without going too high. If you go too high like this, you're going to run into issue. If you go too high up here, it's going to be an issue. So keep it in the lower quartile. You can go a little bit into the beyond the lower quartal but to be on the safe side i usually keep it in the lower quartal and it works perfect guys i don't know if it work for others but if it's something we're on to here please let me know in the comments sorry right? so i just want to share that tell others out in case you think that this touchpad is a dud and of course you find it unusable all right guys ricardo here with we'll another quick tips showing you how to do this on um, your samsung galaxy book pro if you have any feedback please share below as always ricardo saying bye until next time bye